This past Friday, our Board of Regents voted in Scott Hagen as our seventh president here at North Central University. We are very excited. The chapel was probably the highlight this week and uh, being with the students, feeling their love, feeling their anticipation. I really believe this university is going to be a magnet across the nation and the world to draw in just promising leaders uh, from all over the place. So fantastic experience in week one. President Hagen has been blessed with an extraordinary vision. I call it the Christ Eye Vision. That means he is able to literally see the breadth and depth of potential and promise that God has put into you as an individual, and he will be able to see deeper than you can see, broader than you can see, and then his heart and his mind go to work to help them manifest what God has placed inside of you. He believes every life has value, and at the core is a humble man with an enormous heart for people, most notably the vulnerable and the marginalized. Well, the NFL said that Minneapolis executed one of the best public safety plans in Super Bowl history. Well, they say the older you get, the faster time goes, and it's true, and you add a year in higher ed or in a new job like this, and I just can't even begin to explain how fast the year went. It was awesome. Merry Christmas! And we just had a spectacular year of the students, um, the atmosphere, culture, everything was, was, was beat my expectations. There is such opportunity in education uh, through online delivery systems for us to deliver the great DNA and the great leadership and the degree programs of North Central around the world. And that's very exciting to me. Another great aspect of this year was just getting to know the students. You know, the cornerstone of that is chapel. And being in chapel, being around the front in worship, the altar times, and then getting to speak on Fridays and looking all those students in the eye, um, it just meant the world. I'm gonna hand you your degree in about three or four years when you go across that stage. We're gonna look at each other. We're gonna remember today. We're gonna smile at each other. Hopefully we'll know each other's names. And it'll be an emotional moment to hand you that degree because it means that you're graduating, you have reached and achieved a tremendous goal early in your life. Micah's diploma, his graduation diploma. He earned it, Micah earned this. The World Health Organization today declared the coronavirus a global pandemic. Is time standing still or is time going too quick? It's just a weird, way to figure out life um, right now. George Floyd service is being held at a downtown Minneapolis University. This is truly an undeserved honor for our university. I just want to announce as president of this school, the institution of the George Floyd Memorial Scholarship. I've had a flood of emotions lately. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of sorrow, some uncertainty. Uh, what's the future hold? Um, are we just going to survive? Are we going to flourish? We have the best students uh, in the world at this school. Uh, their leadership, their heart, their perspective, uh, black, brown, white, male, female, freshman, senior, grad student. This is a collection of leaders like none other at North Central University. Friends, you are amazing. I'm very proud of you, very, very proud of you. The way our entire NCU community, students, faculty, staff, and our leaders stepped up during this time is remarkable, unprecedented. It's incredible and extremely difficult to even put into words how you've made it through this season. It's been off the charts. You have all made being your president such a joy. It's impossible really to explain what it's like to be a college president. It's so complex. It's very demanding, but it's one of the greatest opportunities a human being could ever be afforded is to lead a college and to be given the stewardship of all of these magnificent uh, students. I feel like I've been in North Central for 10 minutes, not six years. We just want you to know how much we love you guys. And um, you've been a shining light in this role that we've played. And we will continue to pray for you and continue to champion you, each one of you as students, for your future and this school. 
We are not done with North Central. We love North Central. It's in our hearts, deep in our hearts, and each one of you are deep in our hearts. And we thank you for letting us be a part of your family. So this school is the most powerful, resilient Christian university in the United States. To be here in the heart of Minneapolis, when we've gone through George Floyd and the Chauvin trial and all the chaos of this city. You're not a remnant, you're an army. I believe the days ahead are big and they are bright. God bless you.